You know, my first cartoon was published when I was 12 years old mm. in the children magazine. But I never take art in my whole life. I took science, science three. I always, uh, that, that my passion is in, in, in drawing cartoon. Mm. So that's make a difference. I keep selling cartoon. You know? um, so I can say this is uh, my, uh, really my passion. That I want, really want to draw cartoon. I want to do something creative. Mm. So, uh, so I don't have any um, uh, education, formal education in art. This is all self-taught. So, I started by uh, when I was 12. You know, then I continued. I became professional in 1985. During that that time, yeah. I mean, I still draw cartoon. Yeah. I mean, at at daytime, yeah. I do all the hospital work, yeah. the lab work. You know. Then at night I draw cartoon. Uh, finally, say okay, I need to to choose now mm. because of the num because of numbers. Uh, you spend more time mm. in creative works. Mm. You start to lose the calculation. You know, you mm. cannot cal calculate proper mm. numbers. You mm. start to make mistake. Mm. That's what happened to me. Mm. I really hate numbers. I don't know how to uh, write check. You know, I always mistake check. You know, that kind of thing. You know. I had someone had to write for me. Uh -huh. But my first cartoon was banned when I was 17 years old. Because there are some critical cartoons there. Uh -huh. I'm, I was editor for the school uh, magazine bulletin. They have uh -huh. uh, uh, monthly bulletin. I, I like to, to express my view in politics in that time. You know? I, went, I went for forum, you know, bow council forum in you know, that time. So I asked a question. I want to take part, you know. I want to take part. I want to give you. I, I, I send a letter to editors, kind of things. But one day I said, why, why should I do this? You know, I am a cartoonist. They said, uh, cartoonists have to be knowledgeable mm. for me. I, I want to be knowledgeable as I can. Mm. I can put Darwin theories in my cartoon, mm. you know. I can do a, a physics theory in my cartoon, yes. But when I, I was in university, only one year already I quit. Mm. I didn't want to take exam. Okay. I just escaped like that. So of course you fail. You know, I, I regret means that uh, I believe that there are things that uh, sometimes, even though I draw cartoon, you know, I, very early mm. compared to uh, all my clique. When we were in Gila Gila, I'm not so popular. Mm. Yeah. Others are very popular, you know, yeah. they have time, fame, everything, because they are, their cartoon maybe match to the readers, readers like that kind of cartoon, you know, our web, my world, all this, the mm -hmm. pop, pop yeah. things, lah, motorbike kind of things, you know. Yeah. So it takes a longer time for me. Mm. About 20, 30 years, only people start to recognize me. Yeah. So, but I didn't regret that too. I said that maybe the time is not right for me. Because I don't plan anything in my life. I don't plan anything in the future for me. So I don't regret. So I don't know. They say we are regret when we, we say we want something mm. where we cannot get it. But I don't. For me, I don't. I just simply let it flow like that. Let it flow. You know, now this is not a political cartoon for me. No, no, this is not political cartoon. This is cartoon for the people. Political cartoon means that you talk about politics and it involves political figure. This is uh, to be more impact, to create more impact, you need to drag people in it. Mm -hmm. You cannot believe this is political. Political people don't, don't not, not many people like political issues. People want to be, okay, I, if people think like this is uh, relating to them. Why I want to do this? I want I, I how I, I get to this, you know? Mm. When I think that I try to understand what people want. Mm. After that, what, what is inside people's what what make them angry? Mm. What can touch their heart? Mm. You know, what, what thing can touch their heart? That's important. So to draw cartoon for me, my job is to make this complicated thing mm. into a simple drawing. And my drawing always simple. You can see that. It's very, very simple. 
Then you got very early breakfast. My breakfast is on seven. Mm-hmm. <laughs> early breakfast, I will got roti chana and teh tarik. Mm-hmm. Itu wajib. Yeah. From morning till twelve. Mm-hmm. That's the time I used to draw. Um, sometimes I miss that, so it changed the whole thing. But, but uh, assuming that this is on schedule, mm-hmm. it's going to be until 12 o'clock.